Monday everyone. Welcome to today's weekly vlog. I'm going to work today. But I wanted to show you, I got this in the mail. I got it, I get my little clips off eBay. I literally am obsessed. Like don't mind all the dust and everything, but there's like, there's four there, one there. And I have a lot more laying around the joint that I can never find. But I got this white one, I haven't got a white one yet. But it's really good. And then I got this package of rock eyewear and I got these glasses. Just look how cute these are. Dude. Go. Eat, go. Oh. Oh. Are you eating normal food? I mean baby food? Do you want to look at yourself? Look! Hello! Look! Jolly. What you doing? No, you can't touch the screen. Can't touch the screen. Bye, Jolly. Bye. So I just got to work. I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna quickly try race to the like, sign to get some nail polish because I've been painting my own nails if you didn't know. And I really just wanna start getting more colours and maybe doing possibly doing like patterns and like different things with them instead of just doing like the full hand um like one colour. I wanna try to do something cool because that's just like more me. I'm gonna talk to you guys later, hopefully or tomorrow, but yeah. This is me now. I'm going to be going to work most of the night. So, see you later. Hey guys, happy Tuesday. So, it is. Let me just, let me just, let me just show you what time it is. It's 6 28 in the morning. <laughs> in the a.m. Like, literally. Like, the sun's not even up yet. Like, literally. I'm waiting for the sun to come up, if you can see it out there. It's six o'clock. I don't know if anyone else can relate, but if you have like a tradie boyfriend who wakes up early for work, six o'clock, uh, 4.30, five o'clock, six o'clock, whatever time it may be. But when their boyfriend gets up and gets ready, you wake up. Like it's literally annoying. It's really annoying, but I can't go back to sleep like so this is me now I'm awake and I like I haven't cleaned my room I'm not gonna lie like in like a week like a whole seven days like a whole week I haven't cleaned my room I haven't done anything like that like I haven't just sorted my life out basically <laughs> I thought I would do that right now that is why I'm motivated to get up right now because I thought this needed to be done because it does so anyways I'll show you what we're dealing with like, literally that's just all clothes that need to be hung then it just goes over to this like just yeah it's just always cluttered here on my cupboards and everything because there's literally no not much room in my room but yeah that's that so we have to have washing out there Look how cluttered this is. Like my boyfriend's thing. And then we have this one here. Which is cluttered. And like the drawers even cluttered. I'm planning to unclutter them today. I don't know how. Like I haven't known how for a while. But I really want to. Um. So let's see if we can do it. I also want to change our bed around. Because it's literally. It's. If you can see, it's like facing that way and the TV's like right here. So I feel like we need to 
put it back like this way like the what's facing up to the tv we did have like that before but yeah guys i will keep you updated i might do some time lapses and stuff so you can watch me clean <laughs> so fun for me to get motivated and all of that um i watch cleaning videos so really inspires me and motivates me to get up and do it so if you're watching this now and you haven't cleaned your room this week and you want to and you need to then this is your sign and once i start my time lapse you can start to okay let's go Happy Tuesday, we are eating dinner. Yeah. Follow look under the bed, did you clean it? I just left big stuff under there. So if I stick my head under and have a good look, it's only gonna be big stuff. I'll get down and have a look. No, I didn't clean under all of it. Happy Wednesday, everybody. So it is currently like 12.25 and I'm going to go hang out with my friend. We're gonna do a few things today. We have some house inspections. We're going to be moving in together, which is so exciting. Of course, we have to get the house first to be doing that, but I'm so excited for what's to come. We've got, I think, two or three house inspections today they're also going to be like throughout in between and all of that we're going to be going to uh, a shopping center and just getting something to eat uh, i think maybe op shopping not sure we haven't really planned it but we just know what we want to do so i'll bring you along for the day so yeah i'm so excited I'll show you around in the houses if you like. Um, I'll get like a little behind the scenes, but yeah. Can we just appreciate my highlighter today? Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Um, I didn't film yesterday much at all. Sorry about that. I literally had two hours sleep. Woke up at five, four something, five o'clock, whatever and moved my whole room around. So I'll show you that when I get home, like I show you that I moved, I'll, I moved around and cleaned my room. But yeah, I will talk to you guys soon. Hey guys, so you would have seen that I looked at some houses today. I went to Katara, hung out with Olivia. I actually didn't film for the second house we went to, but the second house, oh my god, please legit pray for me that we get this house. Anyways, I went shopping, so I got three bags here. I went to Cheap Store, which I love. So I got, I got a couple things. I got these sunglasses. I already have them in blue. Um, they're just like a really nice, like square shaped, like perfect size. Like, you know, I don't know. I really like them and really good for driving because they're bigger. And then I got this shirt. 
that says angel with like the threading down the middle that's what i got from the cheap store then i went to jj's which i don't normally shop at but i was like okay so i got i just got some pants for my boyfriend because he's always wearing like black pants those ones are a bit like more dressier then i got this drink bottle which is really nice it's like my hydro flask which is really good it's actually bigger too and this was five dollars this was seventy dollars i'm pretty sure more i didn't buy it though so just saying but this one was 29 dollars down to five dollars and it could be more perfect that's all i got from jj's then we went to cotton on which is an amazing fucking shopping, shopping trip so if you didn't know like they have like a they have like this switch on and off sale thing going on in there. I don't know what it is, but they put stuff on sale and they can turn it off at any time. So they had these things on sale for $1 and I was like, okay, I'm going to grab it. So I grabbed some stuff that was on sale. So this was $5. It's a little bag. I don't know. It's like beige and white. So cute. And it has a strap as well if I want to make it like longer. For $5, I was like, okay, I can add you to my bag collection because I have a lot of bags. For $5 as well, I got this blue, purple, and white scarf. So it's for like, you can add it to your hair and you can wear it as a top. You can do all the other stuff with it, just like as a basic. I don't know if it will fit me as a top, I'm just saying. But maybe it would. Basically, just it's just like a navy blue top. Looks really nice. I don't know. I really liked it. Then the real, the real sale items I got, like the real, like the cheap one dollar thing. So all this jewelry, I'm not was literally one dollar each. I decided to get everything. So we have this anklet, which is like really nice, pink and gold. Anklet. Sorry about my nails too. They really like the paint's coming off. I have this necklace which is sun dazed. And it's got the beads on it as well. I got these earrings. I got this anklet. I got these earrings. I got these earrings. They have little cherubs on them. I got these butterflies. I got these earrings. They're like the gold ones. I got this pink necklace with a smile. I got this one which says not today. I got this one. I got this necklace which says lucky. Then I got I got this, but it's this necklace. It's just a gold necklace, and that little thing says lucky. It's like for one dollar each. That's incredible, literally incredible. I'm so excited. So happy I got that jewelry. I'm so happy like about the house inspection that we went to. I didn't video it but like oh my god so amazing so yeah now i'm gonna go home get some groceries on the way home and yeah i'm so excited i'm so happy guys if i can get this house like i would be the happiest person ever anyways tomorrow i have a lip injection appointment i also have a facial tomorrow so super exciting i'll talk to you guys later all tomorrow bye Happy Thursday everyone, I just got dressed, I had a shower and all of that and I'm about to go to my appointments. I have a lip filler appointment and a facial appointment so I'm super excited because my face just needs this like, like not the lip filler, it doesn't need it, I want that obviously but like needs a facial, never had one before so I will let you know about everything. When I'm there, but yeah, I'm super excited. I'm wearing this jumper, which is from Supre. I'm wearing these pants, like those trendy yoga pants. Like they're like tights, but like they go wide leg. I mean, yeah, down the bottom. 
so bloody cute and guess where I got them Kmart for ten dollars and they're normally like I've seen like some on Hannah Orville's like brand she was charging like I don't know 40 or 50 dollars or something six dollars maybe even more I don't really know I'm super excited to go today I'm not gonna do makeup and I'm, I might take photos after it is raining though so I'm not sure but I really would want to this is like the next week when I'm editing this I thought I'd do a little outro because I didn't film the outro I didn't film anything after I said I was gonna get my lips and facial and I didn't film on the Friday so I'm great um but I just wanted to jump on here and let you know like how everything was and a little update of everything so I'm putting this mask on at the moment it's the Morphe 2 Restart Detox Face Mask to really nice it peels off but I went to get my lips done at the Injectable Queen we all know who I go to I've spoke about it before and I've been going to the same Injectable but since I got them done like my first time I just I don't know it's how many days later five days later or four days i think four days later and this is them now um i look don't look great but it's four days later i got an extra meal i think 0 0.8 wasn't a full meal but it was close to so i got 0.8 added into my lips but I didn't get a lot in my bottom so I just added some to my top because my top is the main reason I wanted lip fillers in the first place like I wanted to make the top one bigger so that's what I did so I just went and got a top up mainly in the top in the top one but she does recommend adding the filler into both of your lips because Filler is not only good for like filling, it's actually good for um, hydration and all of that. There's a lot of other little benefits as well, but hydration is one of the main ones. So she just added a bit into my bottom as well, but not as much as she did in the top. Um, I don't bruise and it's amazing. I'm so glad I don't because I worked in saying that everybody is different so if you bruise then it's fine it's normal and everyone's different not everyone bruises so if you bruise don't be like oh my god because it's normal also if you mention my name when you go to the injectable queen you do get a an additional discount normally it is 3.49 for a meal i'm pretty sure it's just like the standard lip if you mention my name you do get um it down to 3.49 so Worth it if you are interested in getting a little stuff. After that, I went straight to my appointment at my facial. It was at Charles Taylor. I'm pretty sure it was at ELC Charles Taylor. It was really, really good. So I went in there with the intention of getting microbration facial, and she explained to me what that was, and it wasn't something that I really needed, but it is really good to get them. So the microbation is where they just get the first layer of your skin up, the dirty, just basically a clean of your skin. Like they pick the first layer off and they clean it and get everything out your pores basically. But cause I, one of my goals with my face is to minimize my pores and get my pores as little as I can and clean. So she recommended me a skin peel so i got the skin peel instead so it was amazing i literally never felt my face be so clean and if you're wanting that extra bit of tlc to your face like extra cleanness professional help with your skin i recommend getting a facial yeah definitely if you try it out let me know what you think because i really really loved it and i'm gonna go back because she did say getting a facial is like getting getting something where it doesn't work the first time around you have to go back 
like it, it works but you have to keep on working towards it to make it better and better if you know what i mean the mesh was really good and i really loved it um i was literally glowing i put a photo on the screen of my face glowing after it was so amazing the skin peel is also good for hydrating and all that and then yeah so a little bit of backstory about the inspections so we went to the inspection it was in Rain terrace if anyone knows where that is we had an inspection up there and i'm not gonna lie the, the house we went and seen as i showed you was not really what we wanted but it was something that we would deal with and something that we wanted we just needed to get out and get a house and start by just starting somewhere so we were still interested in all of that but yeah there's just a lot of uh, moments about it so it was really nice but it was just really small so we'd have we'd obviously have to downsize everything we'd take and this just a lot but like it wasn't bad so then after that we realized like it was sort of like a letdown we were like really excited for it but wasn't what we put our mind to and all of that then we got in the car we spoke and she said maybe we should just see if there's any others um and it was just sort of like a thing that happened and it was like it meant to happen because we didn't have any intent to like go look at this house we didn't plan it we didn't like we didn't have any intention to go to another house whatsoever we never we never even seen the house we never even you know we just saw it and we're like let's go we have time let's go let's go let's go so we went and seen it and i didn't record it um for a reason because the people before us their items still weren't out so i didn't record for privacy reasons because people obviously had their blogging still in there so i was like no just leave it it's kind of worked out um anyway because if i added it and we got it like i wouldn't you would have seen it already so yeah we looked at it and it was just really good like the rooms and compared to what we've seen before the one at random terrace was really small and this one was really really big a bit about it we walked in rooms are massive it has three rooms a really nice big lounge room it has a fireplace it has air con and there's just a lot of ticks that got ticked off basically it has a big backyard it has a shed like an outdoor area veranda it was, it's just really nice and yeah me and olivia were like this is this is the one like we need it we applied there then and there on the spot talking to the real estate property manager we were literally talking to her as we were applying and she came um, she was talking to us about it and i feel like i don't know it was just such an amazing experience and then so on that friday we're going back and forth with the real estate talking about what else we needed to put in and what blah 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 and all of that so we were talking about that and she sent our application to the landlord that night um on friday and on saturday we woke up with a call saying we got approved which is unbelievable so me and kai and olivia moving into a house it is about 10 minutes um from my house that i live in now with my parents it's closer to work um but yeah only that 10 minutes closer but i still really love it and i'm so happy that we done it i'm so happy that the universe bring it to us basically i did also manifest a lot over those three days of like the thursday friday i was manifesting more than ever like it was insane how much i was yeah i manifested a lot and a lot more than i ever have like because i knew i really needed it and i really think manifestation works because got the house so we got approved for our first house i'm so happy and i'm going to be taking you along the journey i'm going to be doing vlogs i'm going to be doing i'm going to do a tour of the house i'm going to be vlogging everything basically so stay tuned for the vlogs ahead i'm sure you'll be watching it and i'm sure you won't 
be disappointed because I know I love watching moving vlogs and all of that shopping for the moving out and just there's a lot to it and I really enjoy it so I'm pretty sure other people do it too I'm speechless like I'm so happy but yes it is Monday the week after I haven't started a new vlog yet it's at currently like in the afternoon that's it that's all I'm gonna give you but so my next vlog which you, you'll see after this one is basically us getting ready to move out packing um shopping um we already went for our first Kmart shop which was on the way like on the Saturday night that we got approved yeah I'm so excited you don't know if you know me and if you know if you watch my videos which if you're watching you will know that how much I needed this and how much I spoke about just wanting to move out how much I like needed it basically I'm so happy to be with you along the journey so please if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe yeah turn post notifications on because you will not want to miss any of the upcoming videos thanks so much for watching <laughs>